other videos of people that can't seem to get their Dazzle Capture cards to work on Windows 10. Now, let me go on to a little story. I had a HP Special Edition laptop. It was state-of-the-art back in the day, and I think it was the first computers that actually came out with 64-bit version of Windows. I needed something to capture footage from cameras and, and stuff like that and from v VCRs at the time. So I went there and I, I purchased the Pro version of this, which they had a Mac version and a Pro version. The Mac version was 200 and something dollars. This Pro version was $150 at Best Buy. And, well, that Best Buy is no longer in business where I bought this at. So, um, I plugged it in, installed the software. Windows wouldn't recognize it. Windows wouldn't recognize it. So I'm like, uh-oh. And then, um, I got told, uh, from somebody from tech support that they have 64-bit versions of the driver on, um... Their website, so I went to their website, downloaded it, and it installed perfectly. It also came with Pentacle Studio 12, um, plus or pro version, I'm not for sure. Let's not talk about that software. That software is what nightmares are made of. It never ran, it never, ever, ever ran stable at all, no matter what operating system I tried it on. Um, so... This thing's been around the block, it's been outside, I used it outside to capture from cameras outside so um it's definitely been around so let's plug it in the windows and and um and see what happens now the thing of it is i did use it on windows 10 um it was like on version 2004 or version 1909 i'm not too for sure it's when i did those live streams of the playstation 2 um but um I've never tried to install it on version uh, H220, uh, which is a version I have right now. So, let's, um... Nothing? Okay. Really, it's just going to work without the driver. That's the that's the um that's the sound and video device. I don't need a driver. That's the first time, because last time I had to end up using the driver. I guess it did install. So, I have nothing that's plugged into this as of right, as of right now. But, um, let's see if we can't um, get a cable going on over here. And see what we can do here. Um... Um, video capture device. Create a new video capture device. There's the dazzle. Now, it will not capture audio from the dazzle, so that's something we can't do. Um... Okay, it's showing a blank screen. All I do is put in a tape. Now the VCR is there. What? There we go. I don't know whether it's capturing that or not, but all I had to do was, um, in a tape and turn on the VCR and there we go.
I don't know why this tape doesn't... There it goes. I thought I was going to have to come over here and install the 64-bit um, driver, but I didn't have to do that. So that's kind of interesting in itself. So, yeah, let's come back over here and let's just bring up this. Get rid of that one, though. Wait, what? Oh. Move this around, move that around. I don't even know which window it's capturing. Yes, I do. It's still on there. Oh, there we go. Ah! Anyways. There's that. So. Anyways, I'll come over here really quick. Can you go to... Take care, everybody. Peace, love, and hugs. And be kind to each other. I love you all.